Welcome back to Prox Hero channel. We are with Backbone. Um, last time we spoke with Samson and it was pretty dicey. So we are back in our investigation, see if uh, we will find any leads uh, to Leslie. Uh, so thank you so much for watching the video with me. If you enjoyed, click the like button, comment if you have any theories about the investigation and uh, subscribe if you're coming back to our channel. And without further ado, let's go ahead and do this. I'm not gonna provoke him. I feel like he is a... Uh, I feel still I can be threatened for my life in here. So, oh, sh there's a sword. That must be my loader. And there's a sword here. Wow. Is the Blade of Heroes? Maybe. What is going on? I just realized, why are you really here? They sent you, didn't they? What? What is wrong with him? Huh? I'm here for me, no one else. They? Who are they? I am anti they? Oh, can I die? <laughs> I'm so worried now. Okay, they, who are they? Say your name. Pronounce it. Howard Lauder. Hmm, I see you're consistent. That doesn't prove anything. I just want to find Leslie and Mai. Let's just talk, okay? I just want to find Leslie and Mai. Let me be. Who told you about the missing girls? It's an open secret. Rene, my partner. Oh my gosh, you guys. We cannot... Um, how convenient. You forgot to mention her before. She's a writer. This was all her idea. She's my researcher. No one important. And you trust her? How do you know she's not a double agent? Why would I be um, worth spying on? I'd be dead by now if she was. Maybe. The timing isn't right. But they'll have a plan. They know. You're right, they're out there, but uh, we're in this together. I'm sure it's not the case. Clarice has got bigger fish to fry than us, man. Oh, he is crazy. I'm her biggest enemy, even if she doesn't know it yet. We can get her together. You don't get to tell me what to do right now. Oh, oh no, we're gonna die. We both want the same thing, Samson. I've discovered things about Clarissa that makes me valuable. Okay, let's play this card. Let's be valuable. Say, I believe you. What then? You're the boss, so use me. You take the fight to them. You're their worst nightmare. Exactly. I'm not gonna make him my boss. Damn straight. They're probably scared of everyone knows you don't... But the loaders, okay. You could catch them off guard. Right, people know not to mess with you. I think he's not right in his head though. Look at him, like, catch them off guard. I don't get... Yeah, let's... Right, I can see in your eyes you are not a killer anyway, wimp. What's the plan? You're damn right, I'm a wimp, the wimpiest. What's the plan? Let's split up, watch our backs, bide our time, I'll give you leads to chase. What's what's the lead partner? Oh yes, please. I'll be so grateful. He's not my partner. That's that's the right attitude, okay? The first girl that went missing. Rose? Rose Klimenko. Oh, okay, Rose Klimenko. She must have started it all. Go talk to her mom. Alright, who is her mom? You're dumb? Good that you have me. Her name is Florence. She's crazy as... Okay. How do I find her? And a mastermind like you must know where she is? Ask around. Alright, thank you for not killing me. Chill, I got this. I'm chill. It's been real. Now get... Okay, I'm gone. Oof. Do Are you touching me? You're weird, Samson. I know something's gonna happen. I I don't know. Was he up to kill us? <laughs> okay, that that really get dicey. I thought it was dicey last week. It was dicey now. Track down Rose Mother Florence, Klimenko. Find a connection between the missing girls from us and okay. 
Um, there was nothing here, right? So let's go on the other side. We will never knock on those doors. Crazy. Uh, we talked to Nada. We need to call Renee at some point. But, okay. This is Gabriella. She's finally ready? Yeah. I'm still busy. I'm looking for Florence Clement. Yeah. Good for ya. Do you know her? Do you know where can I find her? Why? Why would I tell you that? Do you know her? Maybe? I'm investigating the missing girls. Maybe they don't want to be found. Girls on your age are gone. Aren't you scared? My sister is missing. I think Florence's daughter was the first one to go missing. Mm. Me, please. I know how to look after myself. Did you know Rose, her daughter? Rose could be a uh, key finding others. Good riddance. She was a pretty little leech. Were you, uh, were you friends with Rose? What did she do to you? What do you mean? Let's play dumb. I don't actually, I am right now. I don't know what she means by all this. <laughs> Sucked the life out of the hood. Tried to sucker me in J2. But we ain't falling for, the, for her shit. Working in the bind, you mean? What's the shit? I'm glad working in the bind? Yeah, you gotta be really desperate to go there. Not us, mister, nah. I don't want anyone else to go missing. I can help. I'm a desperate, just want to talk to Florence. You must be in a lot of pain, I'm sorry. You can do shit, but if you're upset Florence, uh, I will fucking suck in life. Okay, that woman deserves some peace, you get me? I get it. I would kill for my loved ones too, loud and clear. I'll be good, I promise. Okay. She's at the factory, like always. Don't tell her I told ya. Why not? I appreciate your trusting in me. Down the alley. You can see from here. Thank you. Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> guys, this is taking a, a quite um quite a turn if you if uh. Okay, so and uh, we don't want to go back to the house, don't we? There is really no uh, nobody. Uh, Florence is in a factory, so now let's see how we can get in a factory down the alley, and then we'll possibly. Okay. You know what? Before I will go to the factory, let's go and call Rene. Let's go and call Rene. Just let her know. I spoke to Samson, and he is a crazy. Who now? Bevra's missing daughter Leslie was friend with Samson's sister Mai. It's a lot. Okay, yeah, yeah, that would have been useful contact. Samson turned out to be a paranoid schizophrenic. Mai is missing too and work at the bind. All of them did. So there's a connection. The first one who went missing is Rose Klimenko. I need to find her mother. You know how? Yep. Back soon. Put the kettle on. Not yet. I'll figure it out. Yep. Good luck, detective. Bye, Rene. I don't know. I had a, <laughs> had a feeling I have to let her know. What if they kill me? I cannot deal with people like Samson. Okay, let's go to the factory. Come work. Okay. Ooh, boo, boo, boo. Oh, the guard is sleeping on the job. That should be easy. Just gotta find Florence. Okay. I don't know if he's sleeping, but I'm crouch anyway. Oh. What about this guy? There's a worker. Gotta be careful. Yeah. Ooh. I don't know what I'm doing here, guys. I'm so scared. Almost there. Yes. Oof. 
Okay, there's a woman here, so maybe that's Florence? Yes, oh thank god. The bite snooper? What are you doing here? Oh, I remember her! We talked to her! Okay, this will sound strange, I'm afraid I must... I snuck past the cars, that was pretty amazing. Ah, oh, yeah, crazy. Can I look at Rose stuff? You remember what we talked about before. Florence, I need your help, it's about Rose. What the f No, about Rosie, who sent you? I want to find out what happened to Rose. Rose is missing, but maybe she left clues. Don't think I looked over and over. Can you tell me about her? Every little bit helps. <sighs> We're good to me when we met. I looked through her stuff. I asked everyone nothing. How long has Rose been missing? How did she start the bite? How did she meet mine and Leslie? They work together there at the factory. Look. You gotta go, the supervisor will be here in a minute. Where do you live? Can I come over to talk later? Uh, great man's cross, cross the roadblock five. You wanna see Rosie's room? Yes. Damn fine, we can sneak out now before the super is here. Let's go. Fire as it quickly. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we talked to her when we were sneaking in the by. Oh, great. So, um, yeah, I'd better start looking around. Sure you're okay with this? Feels weird, but yeah, seems honest. I'll try anything at this point. Can you tell me more about Rose? My baby girl uh, was so sweet, strong, always took care of her mama. She wanted the best for me, but do you know if she, uh, if she had any secret hiding places in the apartment? Go on. Yeah, go on. No, it's nothing. This isn't the time to be hiding things. I'm not here to judge. It's okay. Yeah, I'm not here to judge. Spill it out. She respected me, but she didn't want to follow in my footsteps. If I had done more for us, maybe, maybe. Don't blame yourself. You did, you did nothing wrong. Maybes are pointless. Forget them. Uh, and we didn't always talk as much as we might. I get so tired from work. She didn't want to burden me. She shouldn't open up to you. Hmm. I told her she always could, but she just got that look in her eyes. Like she didn't believe me. Sorry to ask, but any reason she could have uh, run away perhaps? Hmm. No, I mean, only some of other girls' places she didn't have much. But her room was special. She called it the... Dream Palace always had a way we words. Thanks, I'll get looking. Okay, just put stuff back where you found it. I want to keep my baby girl's room tidy, of course. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is where she was. Okay, down the street. It's a sad empty vase. Oh wait, oh I see. October. Big yellow flower with thorns look like a cheap decor pieces you get in a supermarket. Well, don't say it in front of her. Okay. Pictures. White petal, small yellow center. The artist was chill, I hope. Okay. Uh, let's not go to bath. <laughs> Just see it. Ooh. Okay, well, let's go to the room. That's what we came for. So let's let's check the room. Much cozier than the rest of the house, as if Rose never went missing, and it's going to come home soon. Poor Florence. Oh, there's a birdie. Is he taking care of the birdie? Okay. Living room terminal. Welcome, Rose. Enter your password. Um... One, two, three. Oh, no, no, no. I should have not tried this, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's try it. Let's not try it because... Okay. Posters. Monkey Boy's groovy. Uh, Katiri, she's the real... Okay. Oh... Uh... Um, Lauren and I used to blast them in our dorm. Oh, good times. 
Bird. Okay, birdie. Drop. Let's. Okay. Let's check the kitchen too. So Femur. If I turn on the lights, I could meet a friend the family of a cockroaches. <laughs> October so this is a yeah so that's a, like a yellow rose right so yellow rose Florence bathroom oh living room small hardship leaves spilling down the pot looking pretty sad relatable hmm. neglected hasn't been looked after in decades reminds me of my childhood Oh gosh, I just, um, I wonder, do they know? the meaning of flowers, a guide to spiritual botany for beginners. I wonder, okay, so look up the white flower. Uh, Billy Spurnis is a common species of a daisy of the family, often considered the, okay, read on. Um, okay. The name Daisy is considered corruption of a day's eye because the hole that closes at night opens in the morning. Daisy, also commonly known as Mary's Rose. Okay, so Daisy. Hmm. Look at the yellow one. A rose. They have it here. It's a flowering plant. Of the genus Rosa, genus Rosa in the family. Okay, rose plants range in size from compact miniature roses to climbers that can reach seven meters in height. Read on. Rose prickles are typically sickle shaped hooks, uh, which aid the rose in hanging onto the vegetarian when growing over it. Okay, roses are also known as great fire flowers due to being heavily featured in a myth of creation. I think it would be the rose, right? Heart leaf, okay, a species of flowering plant in the family. Okay, read on. Part of the plants contain calcium, blah, blah, blah. The plant is known to have an, okay. Sweetheart. Mm. I don't know, I mean, Let's not talk to Florence now. Let's go and see if we can get the terminal working. I don't know. I, I'm not sure if I'm... So that is a uh, hmm. I wonder how it feels. I need to look around. So when finally there was no option for rose. That's I mean, that's why I was white flower. Yeah, that's a daisy, right? Then yellow flower, that's the rose. Hmm. So it must be the daisies though. Okay, let's. Daisy. Favorite band. Oh. The, the Katieri. Oof. Question number three. Pet's name. I need to look around. Baby. Uh. Mm. Bird. Cheer up. What's your name? 
If only you can tell me your name. You okay there, little birdie? Rose, Rose. Okay, nope, I'm Howard. Who's a pretty birdo then? She's not here. Wait, did did she name you? Boing. Your name is Boing? Please, birdie passport. Your name is Boing? Boing, Boing, Boing. Boing is the name. Uh, you make geezer looks clever, Paul. Name, please? Okay, bird. A pretty birdie is. Ignos. Um, pleasure working with you, Ignos. I better, I better go before you do. That must have been the pet. Well, it was Ignos though. Oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. Let's. Whew. Ignus. Welcome back, Rose. Oh my god. Thank god. Okay, okay. I was overthinking it as well. I was like, um, I don't know. Okay, okay. Good, good, good. Oh my gosh, this is... Okay, I love this design. This is great. Okay, navigation. Um, there's nothing there. Okay. Before, sometimes there is a blood inside and outside of my body. I could wash it away, but today no water runs in the bathtub. It doesn't fill me, it doesn't touch my shoulders, my knees, or my thighs. I sit there silently waiting, breathing, letting the air in. She's made of liquor, tears, empty envelopes, nothing in between. I'm others. Oh boy. Um, okay, look at the date though, okay. Today it's Thursday and I'm sick of being bold and the way my voice breaks uh, when I say a thing without meaning it. Hmm. I used to sing in my head, but the theater is now full and the audience comes and goes. For instance, I never see the same face, face twice. Forgetting makes it easier, therefore I remember the music but not the lyrics. Wow, this is heavy stuff! After. Would you like to have some soup? Not really, I'd rather try the main course. The doctor says it's good for you, imagination. Like the time when uh, through slicing and grinding and chewing and speaking the flesh speaks too saying i am i am i am oh uh, my godness this is heavy heavy okay oh boy leslie i love you i'm taking by this New fun, multi-faced, moving force, commanding me in all directions. There was a gaping void inside my body, an expanded space within, left empty, waiting to let in bigger things. Nothing escaped and nothing gravitated around the hall. It just sat there, without desire, pronouncing the meaningless noise of existence. And then, out of nowhere, love returned. I com I encompassed the whole of my being. What was once me now demands a new definition, new borders, new coping mechanism. I come up with the new words, invent new ways to communicate with the widening world in front of the eyes that were once blind. Now I know. We spoke about our future and how it's impossible, but I found a way. Boss knows about us. She mentioned a scavenger that helps people like you and me. There's life beyond the wall and I want to live it with you. Let me know. I'm going to stay with you whatever you decide. Oh my gosh. So they were really lovers. Yeah. Oh, this is... I don't want to read it again. Okay. Work. Secret. All right. 
Oh, here we go. Clients. Oh boy. Buster Carpenter. Interior security thug. Official title is VIP public appearance license. Complete asshole. <laughs> Good whiskey monkey, but always trying to touch the girls. Brexibot, who is being bodyguard to mainly mid level politicians who have been doing things they shouldn't have been. Good source of tipped offs. Keep happy. Frederick. Accountant. Creepy accountant. Talks very little. Doesn't bother the girls directly, but stares. No one likes him. Luckily, he's a lightweight. Passes out after a few. Has mentioned that he managed found for a few apes, signs, Mr. Included, and hinted at knowing about the finances of the bite, hoping he'll slip up and overshare at some point. All right. We don't, I don't see our man, but no, accountant, maybe. Wern Wolf, blacklisted, waves uh, money around like it's nothing, signs to the family, but hasn't been a great source of information. Probably doesn't know anything anyway. Possessive prick got aggressive and started raising his hand at both girls and other customers. Boss threw him out, said she had ways of dealing with him if he ever comes back. Good riddance. Okay. Okay, wasn't it the wolf we met in a, like one of the building? Hmm. Could be just coincident. Uh, accountant? I don't know. That's not us. That's not, you know, Mr. Green. So I don't know. Carpenter guy slivers. Police chief talks shit about interior security. Also complains about science minister having him by the balls. <laughs> Runs his mouth. But not about much useful so far. Likes to be baby talked. Ask Gina to try to track specifics about his relationship with science minister. Ooh. Okay. Project artifact. The fuck could that be? Okay. Doc Rogers, science minister, careful, respectful of girls, drinks only in moderation, secretive, enters through the back alley, only ever request lastly. Hmm. Boss is a direct liaison. No one else allowed to speak to him. Seems to know Boss well. Leslie doesn't like talking to him. Leslie spilled he mentioned Project Artifact once and then shut down. Investigate. Hmm. Yeah. What is this Project Artifact? Bruce Baird. Traffic minister. Um, reserved among people. Loud and arrogant with the girls. Has at least two lovers beside his wife. Breaks about his close working relationship with science minister, but obviously never sees him at the club. Only drinks sweet stuff, no whiskey or beer. Very clearly tries to avoid the specific of his work, but Leslie might be able to get something out of him. Hmm. Well, like a spy? Interesting. Ian McFerrick, lawyer, has a thing for Gina. See, this is a Gina again. Married with children. Um, that's monkey butt, like he's sipping on tea, harmless for a lawyer, so Gina is a good fit. Owns his own firm, uh, deals almost exclusively with apes and high city officials. Has visited with both Vert and Stokes. Um, who was with the Gina? Mm, Guy slivers, okay. Bruce, we have. Alright, Eddie. There's clearly something exciting going down at Science City. I need to tell Renee. Yeah, we need to, but let's finish this. Head of biochemistry lab at Science City. Family man. Likes to get drunk and cry on a girl's shoulder. Seems terrified of Science Minister. Boss told us to keep him sweet. Seen Boss speaking directly to him when she thought was alone. He looked depressed. Mentioned Project Artifact to baby Gina. That's twice now. Must be working on this with Minister. Wow, 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 wow. Let's go. Treasure. Insufferably smug. Food and drink is never good enough, but he keeps ordering the same thing. Everyone hates him, but he throws tips around left and right. Definitely spends money other than this own. Uh, came with Muller in a few times. Asked for private rooms. Tried uh, listening in, but didn't catch much. 
uh, terse conversations. Hmm. Okay. I think we went all of this. Dream team. Okay, Rose Klimenko. It me, angry lady with a big butt. <laughs> okay, glad of the baby Gina. Patient with the man, maybe too patient. High drug sales. Not sure how that happens. Sensitive, try not to give her a rowdy man. Uh, not a factory girl, moved to West End recently. Hiring notes, sweet girl, but not the brightest. Young, look petite, fills the gap in our list. Okay, interesting. Leslie, here we go. <clears throat> factory girl, close to my louder. Uh, lives with her mother and a little brother. Hiring note, smart girl, should fit in quickly if hired with my as friend. Beautiful, when she enters the room, it feels like a summer day. Rumors, she swings the other way. Okay. My. Factory girl, Leslie's best friend, very reserved. Hiring notes, may need coaching on how to handle clients. She is a stunner, all right. Her brother is possessive. Tell the bouncer to watch out for him. Yeah, well, Samson, it's a piece of work. Mm. Operation. Okay. Rose had a system. It wasn't all Clarissa. I feel sick again. Oh, right. Team, hire attractive lawyer girls that uh, know how to make men talk. Start with factory. Click. Wider West and Aria. Offer good pay. No sex work. Just listening, flirting, and reporting to me. Intel. Boss has access to monkey butt supply. Helps loosen thong. Mix 50-50. With hype to make addictive. Uh, 75 to 25. And hook to make them spill. Never let the girls try it. Okay, good. Sources. Create super exclusive VIP brand to attract the big boys. Reward with guaranteed access to their favorite girls. Make sure girl make notes on dirt immediately after session for my eyes only. Wow. Deadbeats. Boss will send up candidates. Get one um, or two special girls to get them hooked and find out if they're ever be missed. Oh, wow. And B. Write guidelines for girls when we're sure invite them to room two with a painting and call Suze. Hmm. I can't believe Rose was on it and oh, yeah, it makes me sick. No way, did Rose and some other girls go over the wall? I don't know. Contact name Dio. Meet under the bridge on the 5th and 12th. She'll take us beyond the wall. Password Daisy Bloom. Okay, we should remember this password. Okay. Okay, nothing in a school. We have work, we have clients, we have dream team. We have, uh, we have this. We have secret, which was this before, during, after. Yeah. Okay. Isn't that it? All right, that's it. Oh man, that was, that was freaking loaded. That was really loaded with a lot of information. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, let's get out. Oh great, it's dark. Let's talk to Florence one more time, but hey, your girl Rosie was not an innocent. Did you learn anything at all? Rose learned something she wasn't supposed to. Um, Rose was spying on customers at the bite. Yeah, she was playing a risky game. What do you find? I've been over a room a thousand times. There were secret files hidden on her terminal. What now? Why would she hide them? I don't know. I need more time to think. Your daughter was an ambitious, sensitive woman, keeping tabs on bad people. Because it was blackmail material and plenty of it. Mm. Stupid girl. I taught her smarts are trouble. Oh my gosh. Okay. You think she's alive? Still alive? I think she's gonna she's gone into hiding. I believe so, I have to. I'd say the chances are low. Hopefully she's in a hiding. Hiding where? For how long? Is she in danger? Don't know, but I'm going to find out. Listen. 
When it's safe, she'll find you, you her mother. If she comes back or not, what's important that she's safe? I don't know, but I'm going to find out. I'm not gonna ask all about her, your personal business, but if you mean it, thank you. And don't go on else looking out for me. I'll do my best, Florence. I can only imagine how I'll do my best. There, there. Okay, we're not gonna go to bathroom now. Oof. All right, so we are back with Rene. So I think what I'm going to do right now, I'm just gonna finish the episode right now here uh, where we are because typically those conversations with Rene can go for a real long time. Wow, what an episode. We did a little hacking. Uh, it seems a little bit more complicated. I still don't know what was the active uh, role of Rose. Um, but we will see you next time. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, click the like button. If you have any suggestions for me where the story can lead to, please uh, comment below. And if you're coming back to my channel, uh, subscribe and I see you next time. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.